What's up, everybody, and welcome to a showdown battle here. I have just before my new OP, just because I'm thinking a little longer on my new OP, and I just wanted to get a video up. So, here we go, guys. This is against Nigis Fresh Kicks, and um, look at that, guys. Me with 1% health. So, anyways, let's get this battle started. Alright, so I'll lead off with Wakamole, the Ludicolo, and he goes for the Dragon Pulse. Okay, so I just go for the Ice Beam, try to get some damage off. He's down to 50% health now, and then he goes for the Substitute. I go for the Ice Beam again, didn't suspect that, and I'm pretty sure he switches out now. He gains a little uh, HP from his leftovers. He goes into Gallade. I just want to keep on Ice Beaming. I didn't expect that he was going to switch out, so then he goes for the Zen Head, but I went for the Surf there, hoping I could maybe get lucky. And then he goes for the Close Combat on Metal Monster, my Skarmory and loses all his defense and stuff. Then Brave Bird takes that thing out. So that's good. It's all good, guys. And then he brings out his Seismitoad. Now this is really stupid. I go for the Brave Bird. He goes for the Earthquake. I mean, maybe that was on accident, and then later on, it'll, uh, it shows me that it's not an accident. I Brave Bird again. He goes for the Stealth Rock. I mean, that's understandable. I go for another Brave Bird. And look what he does again. He goes for another freaking earthquake. Like, is this guy stupid? No, yeah, Skarmory is a flying type, bro. Like, what's your problem? Okay, so, and then he goes to, into his own Skarmory. He's like, you have your own Skarmory? Wouldn't you know that's a flying type? Are you stupid? So, uh, that was really weird. So I just want to go for the rock slide before Metal Monster dies, and then there he goes down. So, then I bring out Zuko the Arcanine, and I want to go for a... Never mind. Yeah, I went for the Flare Brits, didn't know that he would uh, go out, and I have a Choice Band on my on uh, Zuko, so I got I was stuck in the Flare Blitz, and I might as well just kill the Seismic Toad, so that's exactly what I did. And then he brings out his Electivire, goes to the Substitute, I'm stuck in the Flare Blitz, as I said, so I just keep on going for that, because that's probably the best thing I can do right now. And he goes for the Wild Charge, and I still go for the Flare Blitz, and take out Electivire. So, the Rekill kills me, and then I go into my sale. I lose some health from the Stealth Rocks, and he goes to the Dragon Eye. I have Hidden Power Ice, so I go for that, I'm like, wait, is this a defensive Dragon Eye? And then I survive with one health, which is awesome. And then I just take him out with another Ice, uh, Hidden Power Ice, and that's just awesome. And then I go for another Hidden Power Ice, take out his Hydreigon, and then he goes into his own Skarmory again, and I go for the Thunderbolt. And that is good game for you, bro. So, that's it for this battle. I thought that was a really cool battle. I just pwned. You know, that's why I just, I just love Jolteon, guys. So, anyways, thank you all for watching this fantabulous showdown battle. Remember to leave a thumbs up if you enjoyed this. If you haven't already, please subscribe. I'll see you guys next time. Bye-bye.